So hello, uh, this is uh, Ruth Pozuelo from Curval.com and today I'm going to show you how to create a survey with Excel and then view the results with Power BI. Uh, you will be able to share the results also live if you would like to. So I will show you all that. This is really, really cool. So let's jump at it. Okay, so what do you need? Uh, you will need an Office 365 uh, account or a free Hotmail account, either way it works. You need that to access OneDrive. So you will click on here and then click on OneDrive. And then make sure that you access your public folder so everybody has access to it. Okay, so click on that. And then you go here and create new and Excel survey. So you don't need to have Excel actually to do this. So let's run a survey for this YouTube video. So we will ask you your feedback is requested. Okay, so we will ask, did you like this video? No need for subtitles and then the response will be a yes or no. So, um, should we add something more? No, that's enough. Okay, so then you click save and view. There we go. So this is a yes or no, and then share survey, get the link. So now what we are actually creating is a link for participants to access the survey. So create a link have it. Copy. And done. So let's try it out. This new So excellent. I said did you like this video? Let's say yes, it was absolutely excellent. So and if we go back, you see that the response was recorded on the Excel file. Um, so now that we have that, what we need to do is to go to Power BI, and that is powerbi.com. You log in, I've already logged in, and we're going to get data from files. And then you take, if you use Hotmail, you take OneDrive Personal. If you use uh, Office 365, it's OneDrive Business. This is a Hotmail account that we have used. So we access our OneDrive. Here are our, our files. And here's our survey. Is it? I thought it was in public. No, here it is. I said, okay, connect. Okay. Okay, so here we have the, the Excel file imported in Power BI. So what we will do is a simple report. We throw this in there. And then we take one more. And that would take count. I have already faked some answers and then we can do like a chart. Then we can go into title. Um, did you like this YouTube video? 
as a title. You can blue maybe a little bigger like that way. And then we can get uh, make maybe make false red. So something like that could work. Okay, have a text. The back results for Power BI. There you go. Perfect. So, and then if you want, you can actually publish this. Not this. First, we will save it as a report. Survey results. Save. We'll show up here. So, I'm going to show you how to publish this to the web. Uh, you will go here to file, publish to the web, and you will get you will get two codes, one code or one link. So you will get two embedded codes. Uh, the first one is actually a link that you can just post paste on your browser and you will see the report. Very, very easy. The second one is some code that you can actually paste on your website. So if, for example, this is WordPress, if you go to text instead of visual and you paste it and you visualize the results, then you see here the Power BI file embedded which is extremely cool. So what you can actually do is you can run surveys live, not, not really live, OneDrive um, synchronized every hour, as we've seen. But, but um, I mean, your respondents can actually see uh, if they are interested in the results of, uh, of your voting. And if you want to push the data live faster, you can always go down here to survey and then refresh now. So if there's any new data, it will push here and it will push the data here also. So I hope you enjoyed this video and uh, I hope you create tons of surveys uh, using this technique. If you want to try this, down below there is a link of this survey, so you can tell me if you like the video or not. And uh, there is also a link to the live dashboard so you can test it yourself. It will not update directly, but so you will see um, whether the people are voted and then you can come into an hour to see your vote. So thank you for watching and have a nice evening. Bye!